What's up, y'all? It's your girl Tiara, aka Heavenly Ever, and I am back with another video. Y'all, I'm so excited because today I'm finally starting my DIY redo of my patio. And in today's video, I'm going to be laying down my carpet on the floor. I'm going to film it, so if you're interested, continue to watch. Are you okay? Where's your mom? Go get her and let her know you fell, okay? Oh man. Okay, so I got these from Walmart. They're called, wait. They're the Nexus Tile Collection and they are the self-adhesive carpet tiles. So I ended up getting one, three boxes. I hope I have enough. Like, I'm slowly looking around like, uh, I might run out. Actually, y'all, I had these so long ago, like months ago, and I never put them down. So I don't even know if they still have them in the store. But we shall see, let's see what happens. I got them in the color smoke. And um, they're supposed to just be the peel and stick ones. So this is why I got these, because it was easy. They're size 12 inch by 12 inch. They are 100% heavy duty polyester, stain and fade resistant, mold, mildew, and moisture resistant, and anti-static. So let's get to it. I'm super excited. Ow. hurt my nails. I forgot to have my nails done. Ow. Ow. Well, this is how big they are. So I'm just gonna peel this off and stick it down. Ow, y'all, my nail really hurts. They're so childish. You okay? Okay, be careful, okay? Okay. see I definitely ran out I almost made it though so I'm going to definitely need two more to go on here but I'm gonna get an extra one so I can put it over here I'm gonna have to cut them in half and put it there but so far so good we are in there so I'm gonna have to run to the store get some well actually I'm about to call them and see if they have some more Go to the store and get some more, and then when I get back, I'll finish it and show you all the final project. All right, y'all, so I'm back on the patio hours, hours later. I found some more at Walmart, thank God. I ended up getting three more boxes, so I'm gonna see if I'm gonna use all of them. I'm not really sure, but I completed one corner. As you can see, I ran out right here I ran out right here so I had to just end up cutting this one in almost a half 
and putting it down like that. So I'm gonna have to do that all around here. And I'll be finished. What I do is I level one of them and I fold it in half. And where I see the half, that's where I cut. Y'all know I'm not good with measuring stuff out. So this is how I do it. <laughs> I just place this one and that one. As y'all can see, the colors are kind of different. On the paper, it does tell you that um, it's gonna be slight color variations. I honestly don't mind it at all. As y'all can see, it changes right here. So, I'm gonna have to be creative somehow in how I'm cutting this. Let's see. All right, so I finally got this side to there. So now I just have a little ways to go. Okay, everyone, I am completed. I ended up using this little bit of scraps. Um, so I think that was pretty good and I didn't even use this whole box. I still have one more, so I'm going to return that one. <laughs> so as y'all can see, that was very, very easy. It was just hot and although I have a gated, not a gated, um, a fenced in patio, that heat was coming through. Um, it feels much better now, that is a little later, but that wasn't hard at all. And it feels great, it looks good. I'm so excited to finish the rest of my patio, which is gonna be very soon, so I'm gonna film that as well. So make sure y'all stay tuned. Thank you guys for watching, make sure you subscribe, like this video, and comment if you have something to say. All right, see you guys later. <laughs> Oh,